Hey guys, and welcome to Let's Play The Sims 3 Generations. Um, pretty much here. I have so much to do. I guess I can actually make them all go to bed and then start this, but I'm not going to. <laughs> Everybody's gonna get in bed and do whatever it is they gotta do. And um, we're gonna. There's so many things that I want to do. Um, we of course we have to pretty much. We have to um, get to thirty thousand so we can get to thirty thousand so we can get more simoleons and uh, move into a bigger and better lot, build another house. And I know we just like built a house, didn't we? <laughs> but um, literally, I think that the inheritance money is a great way to um, allow players to avoid the mother load cheat. I. I um I I use it all the time, like all the time. As soon as I hit thirty thousand, I get some inheritance money, and that allows you to buy the most expensive car without cheats, and to have the best house without cheats. Like, yeah, you know, no more Control Alt C, or is it Shift Alt C? I don't know. I think it's Control Alt C. I don't see. I don't cheat much. Hmm. All right, so. There is... Is somebody waking up? Oh, why is he waking up? Oh, he's fully rested. Oh, wow, that fast. Um, <laughs> this is the mood that he got. It's plus 12. Um, it's unimaginable comfort. Steven never thought sleeping in a real bed for the first time could feel so, re could feel so amazing. This definitely beats sleeping on the floor. Alrighty. So, um, Steven, actually, he doesn't go to school. Um, today he goes to school tomorrow uh, what does he have in his inventory he has um, French toast French fries and French kissing a book that's actually worth quite a bit of money um, he's about to go hang out in the sandbox right now um, you I know a few of you missed his traits I believe I said them last time but just in case I didn't his Stevens traits are um, slob over emotional eccentric and artistic his favorite um, music is rockabilly, favorite food is cookies, and his favorite color is aqua. And he is the same exact age as Hunter. I forgot his name. Now, there's something about the dreams that um, I believe her name is Cassie. It's either Casey or Cassie. I'm so sorry. I'm terrible, and I should have looked it up before. I started my LP, but I, I start these things so randomly. It's kind of like out of my control. It's kind of crazy. Um, but when you, um, she reminded me of it. I, it does say it in the loading screen or whatever. You can click on a sim, a teen or a child while they're asleep, and you can make them dream of certain things. So let's go ahead and do it. So we clicked on Hunter and we clicked dream about being prom, being prom king, being valed valedictorian, skipping school, or going on a date. Um, let's go ahead and have him dream about skipping school because I do want him to skip school so um, Max here can teach him how to drive and that will make us, uh, that will be basically a huge step, oops, why did I do that, a huge step into um, getting that 30,000 uh, lifetime reward points. Um, also, we are going to send little Miss Annabelle who is a genius and a slob and virtuoso, whatever. We're going to send little Miss Annabelle to uh, boarding school. So, um, yeah, I'm going to have um, Robin go ahead and do that as soon as she wakes up. Enroll in boarding school. She's going to go to Smug Smugsworth Prep School um, because she is a genius. And, I mean, I guess I could send her to, you know, school of peace and love or something but which is the cheapest and then the military school is the cheapest but um smugsworth smugsworth prep school is the highest like it, it costs m the most at um 1600 simillions so we're gonna go ahead and do that to annabelle um which will leave another room available for um Steven, even though I'm not even going to redecorate or anything until we move into um, the other houses and things like that. So, yeah, the new house. <laughs> I'm just going to go ahead and speed this up a little bit here. 
I'm not sure if she's gonna go to she just actually woke up and I I talked that whole time away there while they were sleeping on speed one I bet you guys are like shut up <laughs> Oh, so she's about to enroll her. I wonder if she's going to go to prep school today. Um, yes. And it says, uh, transportation will arrive Friday at 9 a.m. So, she's just going to go to school today, and, yeah. She's about to discuss favorite TV shows with him, but, um, actually, I want you to clean up a bit of this, um, clean up these counters so you can actually make breakfast for your family just a little bit my volume is turned down on my computer so I don't can't really hear much of what's going on <laughs> and she's gonna just serve pancakes and then he's gonna take a shower and we're gonna have him eat some of the pancakes Oh, so I'm speed one. Or speed two. Alrighty. Actually, we're gonna have him just eat some... Eat some stew surprise. He should be waking up soon. He has woken up. Why does he want to have another child with Robin? Mm, not gonna happen, buddy. Nope. You're not going to school today. We're gonna skip school. Did I click dream about skipping school? I don't remember clicking it. That's so weird. I hope I did. I don't remember clicking it. Like, actually clicking it. I know I showed it, but I don't remember actually clicking it. My mind is, like, lost. I mean, I've been sick for the past two or three days. So, my mind is completely out of it right now. Why aren't you going to school? Oh, she's enrolled. Oh, she doesn't have to go. Because she's enrolled in boarding school. Pretty freaking neat. Pretty freaking neat. And let's see here. And Robin, we're just gonna have you kick it up a notch. Oh. And then go ahead and grab a plate. Who's at the door? Oh, she starts work today. Crap, I totally forgot. What's the fun level on this? What's that? Can he do anything with the treehouse? He, nope, he can give it a name. Why don't you go join him in playing? That? And the groceries are on sale for 40% off today, which we're totally going to do. And then we're just going to feed these babies here. And then she's going to take a shower and stuff and just pretty much really get ready for work. And then pay the bills. Just a normal day. Um, what else did I want to show you? Let's show, I can show you guys while she's, and she has boarding school. I can show you guys a princess. Um, let's go and um, prop our periwinkle. Um, in the costume chest. Like, you can actually see it on a girl, you know. <laughs> Ooh, la la. Oh, there we go. <laughs> kinda, she actually kind of looks just like Hunter did, doesn't she? She looks exactly like Hunter, if you ask me. And just have her play pretend or something. For a little bit. I love the way they walk. Look at that. She's so cute. Oh my god, I love that. Um, now, I want to see if I can find where uh, Chase and Giselle live. Uh, da -da -da -da. If they lived over here, I'd probably shoot myself. Oh, and yes, they live over here. This is Chase and Giselle's house. Um, I actually... 
we're gonna have well well we're getting chases or hunters fun up so we can teach him how to drive in one big you know whomping whomping thing oh and he has a moodlet dream came true um the only thing better than having a good dream is having it come true the next day oh did you really just that what a wonderful world and it's from dreaming plus 20 on his mood and so basically if they have a dream and it comes true they're gonna get a positive positive mood lit from it which is pretty freaking good now let's go ahead and visit this household it looks like somebody's over there in the pool and I know you guys can't see that but there's a little black dot moving in their pool area so we're just gonna have um, Logan here visit um, visit their house and I'm gonna put this on speed two until he makes it there and he's in his sloppy jalopy going to, you know, the Celebrity Hills and Bridgeport and to his children. See, isn't that crazy that, you know, the children, like, you kick somebody out, you know, and they have nothing. And they get this house that's, like, bigger and better than yours. And here we are. Alrighty. So, we are about to basically ring the bell to go in. Oh, he's about to be invited inside. Let's see how they're lick in their house. I want to build a house like that. I could never build a house like that. That house is freaking badass. Like, I love that house. And my game just totally glitched there for a second. Or it froze for a second, I guess. It's taking so long. And I'm pretty sure Giselle and Chase should be at work right by now, but they're not. Okay, hurry up and bite us in. And I just want to show you guys their house for a second here. It looks like there's his sloppy jalopy parked. We don't have any, any cars and yeah. Windows to see the pool. And wow, they are pretty much um, living the dream, aren't they? Uh, <laughs> they share a bed, obviously. But this is their house, and it's actually really cute and very modern, and I, I like it a lot. Little fireplace. I'm jealous of Chase and Giselle. I really am. Alright, so we're just going to go back home here. And it was nice visiting you, Giselle. It was nice. <laughs> Alright, so I know. Where are her kids that she's supposed to be babysitting? There's, I swear she had two. Where? Oh, there's the other one over there. Okay. So Chase's fun is all the way up. And we're actually going to have him go to the bathroom. <laughs> And he's, um, he actually got in trouble, uh, for skipping school, so, yeah, of course, if next time we'll, we skip school, we'll, like, go somewhere. Alrighty, so, yeah, put this back on speed one, and we are going to teach Hunter how to drive. Actually, let's pretty much let him off the hook, and then let's teach him how to drive. <laughs> Alrighty. And the kids are kind of hungry, so we'll feed them. I believe after today she should um, at least make it to level 2 in the daycare, which she'll get 3 kids instead of uh, or three toddlers instead of just two. 
What is Steven doing? Oh, he has the, por the Porcelain Beauty mo uh, moodlet. It's plus 12. Uh, this contraption called a toilet does amazing thing. It's like ma It's like a magician. Now you see it, now you don't. And this is um, from experiencing things for the first time. So pretty much whenever he experiences something new for the first time, he's going to get a great moodlet. Or a positive moodlet. And let's check up on... Um, Hun Hunter and Max and I no also noticed that Hunter and Max are wearing the same exact clothes. I did not do that purposely. I really didn't. I guess that's what I get for trying to stick to the generations theme and like picking something that I really really like because I, I really really like that outfit. I should have known like oh my god I should have picked that before. So whenever they're done I will um I'm surprised nobody pointed that out either, because <laughs> I do read the comments, I read them all, and I go back, you know, even after, even days after I've posted the video, and I go back and I read comments, and so nobody pointed that out, at least nothing that I saw, no, no one pointed that out, um, but maybe I overlooked it, but I don't think I did. Anyways, um, so, yeah, I'm gonna change, um, Hunter's outfit a little bit here, whenever he's done learning how to drive, and see and by then hopefully by then they should be at 30,000 because he's almost at 28,000 that's gonna give him 2,000 so we should be able to move and all that good stuff oh, they're both a little smelly so we're gonna just change their diapers oh Max has to go to work shoot well she can finish teaching him how to drive after work. And he wants to reach level 8 of the medical career. He's level 6 now. Did he have a research book to read? No, he did not. What is she doing? She's building a sand castle. <laughs> <laughs> they never use the treehouse. Like, they never go to the treehouse by themselves. <laughs> Crazy. And I'm surprised Hannibal hasn't been on this thing like Giselle was. Giselle was on that thing like crazy. Oh, she didn't... Or sloppy jalopy. Okay, he's in his inventory. So, oh, and she just got paid for um she just got paid for her day, which was only a little over two hundred bucks, so where is um Where's Hunter? Oh, let's go up. Let's see here. There's so much crap in their inventories. I hate it. Oh, there's so much crap in there. All right, I'm gonna have her do this a little bit, and then we are going to teach. Finish teaching. What's his name? Hunter. How to drive. Where is he? Oh, there he is. Alright, so, I'm gonna teach Hunter how to drive. And, he, and um, what's his name? Steven. I forget their names often. He is, like, totally having so much fun on this water slide. He's been on it, like, all day long. All day long. So I'm just gonna have Steven um, use the bathroom and take a shower before he goes to bed. And Hunter actually goes to school tomorrow too. I should have him, um, what's the word called? I should have him um, in bed by now, but I'm, I really want to finish teaching him how to drive. You little missy. You, you, you.
see where they are. Come on. Oh, he's gonna be a while before he before he does that. So we're just gonna send him home. Cause that's gonna be a, a long while before he actually finishes. Didn't they just pass their home? I think so. I wish... Mm, I wonder if they had a sleeping elixir. If he had a sleeping elixir made so he can get some badass sleep. Ghost potion, bladder flow, no, no, no. Nope. Well, I'm actually going to have Hunter sleep in this bed. Sleep in Robin's bed for the night just to get him up to speed on sleep so when he goes to school he can, um, I don't know, it won't be so bad when he goes to school. And we're just going to actually pretty much have everybody go to sleep. I'm going to have Robin just sleep in Hunter's bed for the night. I love the fact that she's in her little uh, outfit. Outfit. <laughs> Alrighty, and um, while he was, uh, what does he still have that? Mm. Oh, while he was, uh, Max was at work and while everyone's sleeping, he got a, um, he got an opportunity, um, so, um, to test for disease at, at these random locations, and he's gonna get, like, in civilians and stuff, and for work, basically, an opportunity. So if you're like, what's going on? How? Why is he doing that? That's why. That is pretty much why. So he's going home and he's actually going to sleep. Is he home yet? No. He's not home yet. But we're going to just pick up the pace a little bit here and put this on speed two. And everybody's just going to eat a bunch of things. He's awake too now. Everybody's on yellow except Annabelle. <laughs> I am such a terrible person, aren't I? Oh my, and look at this toilet. Oh my god, can I turn these lights on? Turn on, uh, there. Thank you, Robin. Yeah. Wait until she gets up and just look at that filthy toilet. Look at that toilet. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm surprised there's not like poo in there or something. <laughs> it's like filthy. Totally filthy. Alright, everybody's on green. Just like that. I'm so good at this game. And, um. No, you go shower. And where's Annabelle? Cause, because Annabelle, um, actually, Annabelle goes to boarding school today. She leaves, and leaving for boarding school is, honestly, it's nothing, it's nothing, it's not like the, thank you, Stephen, at least he, you know, at least he farted in the bathroom, and it wasn't, like, at the dinner table. Um, <laughs> um, what was he saying? when they leave for boarding school it's nothing like special or dramatic or you know anything so and I want I did want to change um, his um, outfit let me plan his him a new outfit before he goes to school Mm -hmm. Let's see here. So, so. Every day. Um, let me... Should I just give him a regular t-shirt? I don't know. I don't know. Hmm. I think, um, what was his name? Chase had this. Or something like... No, Chase had a sweater. Okay, so we'll, we'll go ahead and put this on him. Let's give him the... I like, I really like the brown. I like the brown on him. 
and just switch up his shoes a bit. Alright, and there pretty much is Hunter. Quick new outfit, not gonna spend all day changing every little thing. <laughs> Alright, school bus should be here in about 10 sim minutes, so... It's funny, when I start saying the school bus should be here in about 10 sim, sim minutes, it like, as soon as I finish the sentence, bada boom, there it is. She was to learn a new recipe. I forgot all about, like, actually trying to do her lifetime wish. Did we, have we bought, like, any new recipes or anything of the sort? I don't think so. So, they're going to both meet new friends. So hopefully he can win valedictorian and prom queen, or king, prom king. Put sloppy jalopy in the driveway. And her kitty should be here, actually. Oh, she doesn't go to work today. So, we're just going to watch Annabelle and say goodbye to Annabelle. Where's her ride? Come on. Are they really late? Oh, I think she's leaving now. Nope. Yep, she's leaving. Goodbye, everyone. I'm off to Smugsworth Prep School. Don't forget to call me while I'm gone. I'm still your kid, even though I'm far away. So, she is getting picked up in a limousine on her way to Smugsworth. Smugsworth. Aw, so she's basically gone. And this, in a second, should black out. And we won't be able to control her control her or anything now we can easily just pick up the phone and call her and um, pick up the phone and have her removed from boarding school so she can come back at any time and um, when she ages up into a teen you have the option of allowing her to come back home and you also or you can keep her there and paying another 1600 simillions. So there are tons and tons of options for that when it comes to bringing her back. Um, you know, you can let her stay or, you know, whatever. Anyways, so not tons and tons of options, just more like two, I guess, or something of the sort. All right, and then, so I guess this is, does he go to work? Why does he have to wake up at 11? Hmm. I don't know. Anyways, guys, <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and leave it off here. And um, I missed you all for those two or three days that I was gone. Um, so, yeah, um, I will talk to you guys sooner than you think. And you all have a super fantastic, awesome, amazing, splendid, superb, outstanding, perfect, um, extraordinary day. All right, guys. Bye.